Hello Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. Let's take a look and see what is it that is manifesting for you all. Any messages or advice, who or what is showing up around you, what you need to know. Always take what resonates, leave out the rest. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram, I... I'm spiritually golden on all platforms. If you are interested in a personal reading done by me, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all with a link to my website, spirituallygolden.com, for you to view the different options for readings. Okay, let's take a look. What is going on here for you? Cancer, we have the Five of Wands, Knight of Cups, ooh, Wheel of Fortune, Six of Wands, holy snap <laughs> and the two of wands at the bottom first of all first of all things your life is about to change and but this isn't just like um this isn't this isn't just like a small this is not a small change this is a huge this is a big deal this is a big deal. Look, I'm seeing happiness. I'm seeing abundance. Okay. Happiness and abundance. Six of Wands, Wheel of Fortune, the Chariot. You have abundance coming in, Cancer. I'm seeing also a lot of happiness. Not just abundance, but happiness. An abundance of happiness. It's like you're you're in a you're on a different frequency right now literally in a different frequency <laughs> i'm saying that you've had your fair share of um losses or failures in the past okay but you took that you took that failure or failures as an opportunity to learn so some wheel of fortune reverse right now feels like you may have felt like you have had some bad luck like you've been in a cycle of bad luck like random things just happening and you're just like what the heck is going on what what is like why do all these um bad things keep happening it, it feels like there's been a lot of frustration over this a lot of challenges and obstacles and you've gotten to this point where you're just like like, what is really going on here? What's going on with my luck? But, but this is not for long. Not for long, Cancer. Okay, things are about to shift. You are entering a cycle of success. Of success and abundance. Listen, this is public success. It's like everyone who has seen you fail is about to see you win. Everyone who's seen you struggle is about to see you thriving. Literally. Why the five of wands? What was this challenge? What was this challenge here? Okay, eight of pentacles. So yeah, you feel you've been working really hard towards um, a natural progression in your life and working hard towards your passions, towards uh, and dedicating yourself towards your own self mastery building something here for yourself staying very committed and trying to create some sort of forward momentum forward movement and i'm hearing delays it it seems like there's been um delays or just complete blocks stops things have come to a stop things have been stagnant but this it, this is about to change you are about to in enter your your winning season now okay it's like you've been in that losing season. Now you're entering the winning season. This is about a matter of like keep going. I don't know where you're going, but you got to keep going. This is this is just following following the direction that you started. For some reason, things had to be delayed for you. Things happen for a reason, especially with when it comes to this Wheel of Fortune. Things are happening for a reason that are out of your control, but know that it's happening with a purpose. I'm seeing purpose. Like, things are happening for a purpose. Um, it's happening for a purpose so that when this success does come, you're able to um, 
you're able to keep it or when this success comes, it comes with abundance. Yeah, you never really know. You never really know why things may be um, happening until the blessing comes. Okay, tell me more about this success achievement that's about to put a huge smile on your face. Rewards, okay. Hmm. The High Priestess. This is about a knowing. This is about you having... It's like you know that this is coming. This is something that you have felt. You can feel this success coming or you can feel that... Um, Things are happening for a reason. I'm seeing that there's a strong amount of trust that you have that keeps you going. And you're finding a success. You're successfully overcoming um, disappointment and grief. Overcoming um, like a, a loss, right? You're And it's like the tables are turning. The tables are turning here. That's all I can say. Tell me about this chariot. This is, um, chariot is like that success, but success that doesn't come without a struggle. It's like forward momentum, moving forward, duality. Um, it's, yeah, it's like you're choosing to move towards a goal with two opposing forces, with some challenges with some difficulties, but finding the willpower to continue moving forward. There's about to be forward movement now. And this is this is a sign to continue to move forward here. Tell me more about this chariot. Why the chariot? The hermit. Oh. And justice. You got lots of major arcanas that have shown up. So... This is about like this success. You may have to keep it um, to yourself. You may have to keep this to yourself. The people that are meant to see it will see it. But I'm hearing working alone. I feel like you're meant to be kind of working alone on something right now. Maybe doing a little, being in a little bit in that hibernation mode, that hermit at this moment, continuing to move yourself forward because you're so close. You are so close. And we have this Knight of Cups over here. Someone who is coming up with a love offer. I'm seeing love. Oh, Someone wants to uh, express their love for you. Someone wants to express their love for you. And you're feeling like this is someone who's going to make you feel chosen um, every single day. Someone who's coming in very gracefully. Sweep you off your feet type of energy. Get ready. <laughs> Get ready. Tell me why the Knight of Cups. Clarify this Knight of Cups. Two of Cups. Oh, no. <laughs> Love. This is someone who you care about equally. This is someone who feels a very strong connection to you and is following their heart towards you, making you a, a love offer, a, a proposal of some sort to join forces, to have a deep union with you. They want union with you. You're entering a union with this person. This is someone who you have mutual feelings with. But with this Wheel of Fortune reverse, it feels like things have kind of hit like a... Uh, um, like you've, you've hit a bump in the road. But things are about to change. Your luck is about to change in in your love life. If you have someone in mind, think of them. Let's take a look and see how they feel about you. About this situation with you for the rest of the month. The person on your mind, Cancer. We have the Eight of Swords. Ten of Swords. Three of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Cups. Okay, stress. So you have someone here who is feeling um, a lot of li limiting and beliefs and, and thoughts here. They're feeling stuck. 
and the feeling like they can't really see something. Okay, clarify this Eight of Swords is our feelings. Maybe even a little blindsided. Ace of Cups. So this person does feel love for you, like to the point where they can't contain it. Um, and they are deeper feelings. But they are, it feels like they're kind of sabotaging things right now. They're, yeah, they're sabotaging. They see you as someone who is very self-reliant. Like you don't really need anyone. They see you as having a good head on your shoulder, being commitment worthy. They see you as someone who has, uh, who's able to, provide for themselves you can take care of yourself you can afford the things that you want in life they are they're kind of feeling like you're out of their league like you're out of their league in some way here why the ten of swords and sun Seven of Pentacles. Okay. So it seems like this person has some deep wounds that they're still healing. They, they have some baggage here. This person has some baggage. Um, but this month, they are still want, willing to work towards things. And collaborate with you work with you put in the work towards building something stable here with you so they're they're still willing to to do what they need to do to show you that they are willing to pull in energy as much as you are but they're definitely nervous they're intimidated they're very intimidated here over your over you and your lifestyle or your success okay so I mean happiness and abundance six of wands chariot that is that is pretty serious <laughs> that's pretty serious this is this feels like oh just this this is just the win that you needed to like keep you going after all of this like these like random challenges that have been happening and feeling like you've been kind of stuck in cycles it's it's yeah it's about to end i would say the numbers five ten six seven those numbers could be synchronicity special days five 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 ten 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 sixty six six seven 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 I'm seeing the letters F L P R S C N D. The old letters could be in your name or someone else's. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. And I hope you have an amazing rest of your day by Cancer.